Now inspect the engine bay area. This rear grille lifts up for quick and easy access to the diesel and DEF or AdBlue fill points. It's important not to mix the diesel and AdBlue fill points up. On JCB wheel loaders, the AdBlue or DEF fill point is clearly labelled with a blue cap. To raise the engine cover, release this clamp and open the battery box. Here you can access the engine cover controls. Once you have checked the area above and behind the cover is clear, press and hold the up arrow. This will raise the engine cover and you can now access the engine bay area with minimal obstruction. Remember, isolate the electrics before working on the machine. The engine bay layout provides easy access to primary and secondary fuel filters, as well as the water separator, the hydraulic oil fill point and filters, the engine oil dipstick, fill point and filter. The engine oil drain point is located on the underside of the machine with the coolant tank and fill point located at the top of the engine bay. Note the transmission oil fill point is located near the cab steps. The two-stage engine pre-cleaner is located here. It's there to prevent dirty air being drawn into the engine. This works in conjunction with a scavenge particulate system which prolongs filter life by removing larger particles before they reach the filter. When completing your daily inspection, check the air filter intake holes are unblocked to allow maximum airflow. The cooling packs are stacked together at the rear of the machine for ease of access. This mesh on the engine cover prevents larger particles being drawn into the cooling packs. Particles small enough to pass through this should also pass through the cooling fins. However, it's good practice to regularly inspect the cooling packs to ensure the fins are not plugged and free from any damage. This optional swing out fan at the rear of the machine provides further access to the cooling packs for particularly dusty applications. Once the relevant checks are complete in the engine bay area, you can now lower the cover. Remember to ensure no one is working in the engine bay area and that any tools or objects have been removed. You can then reinsert the isolator key and lower the engine cover. These loaders are highly productive machines with safety features built in. However, it's essential you understand these machines before putting them to work. Please always refer to the operator's manual for further information. Thanks for watching.